So what is going on everybody my name is Mehul and welcome to your fourth MongoDB tutorial in which I'm going to show you how to properly do an insertion and getting the data as well and uh, well you have already seen that how to do that but I'm going to show you how to make use of a script to do the same right so inside your script what you have to do is uh, write db equals connect and then 127.0.0.1 and the port number this 27017 I guess for the default one and then your database name right so this is MDB or let me just first show you how you can delete your database as well so just say use MDB which your database name is you know you can just show DBS so now you want to delete MDB so use MDB and say dbs dot drop database hit enter well uh, not dbs actually dot db dot drop database hit enter and you will see that show dbs shows none so all cool now what I'm gonna do is simply say use mdb right here so that uh, it does not kinda make sure uh, it doesn't kind of appear in your show DBS so now connect it like that in your DB and then what you want to do is I'm gonna create a function which says insert data and what it's gonna do is that it's gonna say DB dot MDB dot insert and actually this is MDB is a collection it's not necessary to name it database I can just name it names dot insert and I would just say my object and right here I will just pass in my object as well so then I can do function get data back and uh, inside here now the equivalent of this for the terminal would be way too short but for JavaScript we have to write a bunch of stuff so I need to say your cursor is uh, DB dot my collection name is my object no 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 it's names actually dot find and then while cursor dot has next as next then I'm gonna say print JSON it will just print a JSON cursor dot next right so I'm gonna show you that in a moment how to do that from terminal itself and it's way too short but it's up to you what you prefer so what I'm gonna do is say load script dot js hit enter now it said connecting to this and then it's written true so what I'm gonna do is write insert data and then hello to true right hit enter now I want to get the data back so get data back hit enter you can see that I got my data so this is how it kinda looks like what you can do is uh, inside here what you can do instead of calling this get data back you can just get this data in one line by saying uh, db dot uh, mdb dot find right wrong because our collection name is db.names.find hit enter you can see that this line and this these three lines are kind of equivalent and actually with the this names.find you get one more advantage and that is you can write names.find.pretty right so when you write that pretty well actually this is kind of one liner but uh, when you get a lot of code then it would just show you a mess of out of it so what you can do is I can write insert data and then another object while true and now if I say db.names.find actually let me just zoom in you can see it kind of looks like this and if I say pretty hit enter so it kinda looks nothing different but uh, because it's kinda already readable and pretty but it would kinda make difference if uh, the output is all you know 
messy and all that stuff so that is how pretty much you basically retrieve data and set data as well so if you can see now these two are the records in your collection and these are actually the documents and this names is your collection right so that is how you pretty much do a basic insert and getting data back with the mongodb and that is all for this tutorial and if you liked it then don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching i'll see you then in the next one